grace be unto you and peace from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. It's the 21st of February, the first Sunday in Lent, and you may have been following the palms from last Palm Sunday to burn to ashes to forehead, and this is then what happens to the remaining palms. We're here in the memorial garden and ashes to ashes, dust to dust. And when next you see this bowl, there'll be salt and fire in it. But for now, the azaleas are out. You've got the time, take a walk with me. some color for you. And remember when these were barely, barely in bloom. I'm going to put this back and as I say, when next you see this, likely to be not sunshine and there'll be fire in it but not of palms. And at one point I invited you to look at this, notice it's cut back, and in the coming weeks I think you'll find some fascinating things there. Come on in. And it's Lent, crosses are draped, and yes, black there, not purple for the theological reason that the black material drapes easier than the purple. Here's a corner that you've seen before and for this Sunday. The reflection, the light, and from Bishop Stephen Charlton. The long, slow struggle with the virus continues. It seems like it has been with us for years, and the work of repair and restoration continues. It seems like that will take a long time, too. In the meantime, people are working as hard as they can to send their kids to school, make enough pay the rent, and put some food on the table. It has been a lean winter. In the midst of all of this, a few words from me may seem of little comfort. So let me remain silent and just sit with you just for a few minutes. Together we will enter the quiet that surrounds us Eyes closed, we will listen to the soundless sea of the Spirit 
that wraps around us like a warm blanket against a cold wind, we will feel that warmth-like energy letting it soak into us down to the bone deep inside our souls where we need it the most. We will be lifted up. We will be strengthened. We will be blessed. And all without saying a word, for the Spirit knows before we speak. Come sit in silence and see, even when this video ceases, the silence and Spirit lives on.